Okay, I'm just learning how to use OBS Studio. So what I did was I installed the daily build of Ubuntu, the LTS, and uh, it didn't load correctly, but when I installed the right the uh, 2004 the 2004 version, it corrected the installation media for this 2204, um, the jellyfish or whatever it's called version. So in fact, if we go to the uh, about in the settings, uh, you'll see it's Ubuntu Jammy Jellyfish Development Branch. So in about a month, they're going, this will be the LTS. And it's running GNOME version 42 beta. And the windowing system is Wayland. So I thought you might find that interesting. So the bar, the activities bar, is on the left-hand side of the screen, as I recall the previous Pre Gnome uh, previously having. I just downloaded OBS Studio. I tried Simple Screen Recorder, but I forgot that I had not included um, some of the stuff needed to run MP4 and H.264. So there's this thing here that says Install Release, Firefox Web Browser, Thunderbird Mail, Files, Rhythm Box, Libre Office Writer, Ubuntu Software. There's the help. This is the GNOME help. Lists my volumes. If I go to Show Applications, there's uh, the Video Player, Calculator, Text Editor, Document Scanner, System Monitor, Terminal. There's a Utilities subfolder with advanced network co configuration, disk usage analyzer, backups, disks, image viewer, document viewer, archive manager, passwords and keys, logs, characters, and fonts. After utilities, you have cheese. In fact, let's test this out right now. Uh, video let's see so no effect is coming through with these lines on it so something's not right about that for cheese um, let me verify if I go into the upper right very similar to a previous version of GNOME um, go to sound and okay the correct microphone is being used here all right so cheese uh, is wait, is it recording because it had a red dot on it mm -hmm. yep okay all right so cheese additional drivers what does that do? If we click that, ah, so this I believe is where I would go to enable the proprietary drivers. So I'll need to look at that. Um, I'll riot solitaire, whatever solitaire game that is. Calendar. Today is the 23rd. Firefox web browser. Let's see what version of Firefox this is running. So you click the three lines there. You go to the help. Click about Firefox. It's Snap for Ubuntu Canonical 002. And they are running 98.0.1 as the version. So it's uh, it's from the Snap Store. This I think I had to say yes 
with the Firefox uh, for it to be in the, uh, from the Synap. Um, all right, so where were we? Um, Firefox, language support, system monitor, LibreOffice, LibreOffice Calc, terminal, LibreOffice Draw, Utilities, uh, I read those to you, LibreOffice Impress, LibreOffice Math, Live Patch, Mahjong, Cheese, we looked at that, Mines, OBS Studio, which I installed, Power Statistics, Remina, what's Remina? Remote Desktop Client, okay. Remina is a remote desktop client. I move the mouse wheel and it goes towards me and it moves over one. Settings, Shotwell, I believe that's a photo viewer. Software and updates, software updater, startup applications, startup disk creator, Sudoku, to do, transmission, uh, transmission, was a BitTorrent client, and VLC Media play Player I installed because I was uh, having a problem viewing certain videos. And uh, I believe that is everything. Let's look at the system monitor. So I'm pretty sure HTOP is not installed. Um, I'm using currently 2.3 gigabytes out of, and I'm recording. Uh, from what I understand, OBS is pretty system intensive. In fact, is there, um, see, OBS is using 12% of the CBU, 257 megabytes by itself. And uh, it's probably using other uh, other stuff. Um, but I, I, ha I happen to have uh, roughly 32 gigabytes of memory for my RAM, so it's not that big a deal for me. Uh, I'm r I'll show you my system specs before I shut this video down. Oh, a uh, file systems may be of interest. Um, so again, go to settings, go to the about, and I'm running an AMD Ryzen 3 2200G, which has the Radeon graphics, but I have a separate graphics card the AMD Radeon RX 5500 XT. And uh, there you go. That's Ubuntu. This is Ubuntu Jammy Jellyfish. This is the daily build. The, this will be released as a long-term support in about a, a month. Uh, I believe April, uh, somewhere around April 21, I think they said. Uh, Right now, it's running GNOME version 42 beta and the Wayland windowing system. And thank you. We'll see if we can upload this now.